A uh, Sioux Falls restaurant is getting a third helping of technology to assist its staff. Uh, the, uh, for the past year, the Pizza Ranch on 41st Street has been using a pair of robots to bus tables. And now the management may soon be adding at least one more robot to its staff. Perry Groton returned to the restaurant a year later to get a performance review of the robots in tonight's Eye on Kettle Land. Artificial intelligence is making career advancements at the 41st Street Pizza Ranch in Sioux Falls. Hi, nice to meet you. Please follow me. The restaurant hired a couple of robots last year, nicknamed R2-D2 and C-3PO, after the Star Wars droids, to bust tables. I kind of consider them my, my babies. I was here the first day we got them when they were quote unquote, you know, born in the store and I've been kind of doing all the setup. Manager Josh Dockler handles the troubleshooting should the robots act up. Sometimes they're like my teenagers. There's some days they work fantastic and there's other days they just, you know, just have a little bit of an attitude. And But you know, we all have our good days and bad days, even, even AI. But the Pizza Ranch says the robots' good days far outnumber the bad. We've loved them so far. Um, they, they travel on average about 30 miles a month, uh, so that's just a lot of steps that our, our busing staff doesn't have to take every single day. The robots are programmed to deliver dirty plates and silverware from the dining areas to the dish room for washing down the hallway. They're very polite. They don't, don't get in your way too much. They will say excuse me if they get stuck behind you or anything. Uh, we have little kids coming up to hug them every now and then. Management says the robots are strictly here to help the wait staff and not put anyone out of a job. We kind of don't see maybe that they've replaced an employee, but they kind of make an employee's job easier or make an employee more efficient um, so they can focus on some other things like helping our guest experience. Regular Pizza Ranch customers have gotten used to the robots making their rounds, but the bots were more like a culinary curiosity at first. Other people have that same reaction like, oh, you know, and then they look for staff, you know, like, are there still staff around, you know? <laughs> so it's fun to see them. The robots undergo regular maintenance so they can keep on their toes or more accurately, their wheels for a 12-hour shift. We got to clean the wheels periodically. We got to wipe them down just because they'll get dirty every single night. But um, wear and tear, they've been pretty good. Sometimes the robots lose their bearings and require a GPS reboot. A lot of the troubleshooting, you know, is just taking it back to a, a home spot, hitting two buttons, and it relocalizes itself. So it's all all pretty easy to use. The robots have been so successful, they might just be working themselves out of a job. The Pizza Ranch is looking at testing a third robot, one that's much bigger and can haul larger loads, possibly forcing these robots into an early retirement. They might go to Boca Raton, you know, they might go play some golf. I'm not harm sure when they take them back where they're going to go, but... They've, they've lived, they're living their good lives here. The newest generation of restaurant robots are equipped with four shelves instead of the current three. I'd just be able to hold more dirty dishes, a uh, little, little better designated spot for garbage and things like that on them. Um, so hopefully just make us even that much more efficient. The replacement robots may arrive later this summer. So for now, these robots are still gainfully employed keeping the pizza ranch on the cutting edge of robotic technology, one slice and one plate at a time. Have a good one. Enjoy. With Eye on Kello Land, I'm Perry Groton. And the pizza ranch leases the robots from a Texas company for about $800 a month, and they eventually may decide to buy the robots outright at a cost of around $13,000 a piece.